Hello and welcome back to another Computer Sluggish tutorial. So today I'm going to be showing you how to defragment your hard drive. So this is going to speed up your computer, your Windows machine a lot more by doing this process. If you are finding your computer is a bit slow, a bit laggy, this will certainly help because what this does is basically imagine a library with all its books and if all the books are all over the place, then it's going to be harder to find the book that you want. But if the books are all categorized into a certain order, so A to Z, you could instantly go to the letter of what book you want and you're going to find it a lot easier. So that's what this does, defragmenting. So, first you need to open up um defragmenter so we're going to click on our search windows and we're just going to type in defrag and we're going to click on the first link so as you can see it's now got optimized drives so we've got our c drive our d drive our e drive you might not have those drives um you'll only have the drives that you do have on your computer so Solid state drives. A lot of people say you shouldn't run a defragment on a solid state drive. I've never ran one and I never will because I don't think that you should either. Because unlike your normal hard drive, it's a bit different and yeah, it you don't really want to mess around with SSD. Plus they're fast anyway, so there's not really any need for it, to be honest. Okay, so first things first, you need to select the hard drive that you do want to defragment. And you can go analyze. So what analyze is going to do, so I've just selected that now, as you can see, it's analyzing. It's going to tell us whether it thinks that hard drive needs to be optimized or defragmented. And it says current state is okay. So, technically, I don't need to defragment that drive. It thinks it's fine. So, as you can see, though, this system reserve drive, which I've never, ever done anything on, it says that it does need an optimization. So, if you've got that message there, then you definitely need to defragment your drive. So, to do this, select your drive, and you simply need to press Optimize. OK, so by pressing optimize will defragment your drive, but Windows is very clever and it does do this for you sometimes if you've got the option turned on like I do. So as you can see here below, before we run our optimize, you can see scheduled optimization on. Drives are being optimized automatically. It's being done weekly. So you can go change settings and if yours is off, go on to change settings and then you can run the schedule. So this will do it for you. So you will never have to worry about doing this ever again manually. Windows will sort that out for you. So that is ideal. Um, yeah, that is ideal if you don't want to be messing around and having to remember to do this every month. So let's just close that for a second. And we're now going to select the drive that we want to optimize. And we're just going to simply press optimize. So as you can see, it's now running the analyze and it's going to do a couple of passes. So it do pass one, pass two and pass three. And then, yeah, it'd be pretty much done. But it normally does take a while. OK, so if you've never done this before, expect it to take quite a long time to defragment so that is pretty much it it's as simple as that so if you did find this tutorial helpful hit the like button below and subscribe for more computer sluggish tutorials